What's up guys? This is the Roveman and I am back to bring you the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the Ottoman Empire. So to round off where we left off, in the last episode we had we pretty much spent the whole episode um, upgrading, rebuilding, and doing all sorts of investment stuff, but this time the Georgians are selling out from the last remaining territory to attack us. So we've got lots of line infantry and lots of cavalry, uh, so we need to be a bit careful because our cavalry is pretty weak. What is it? Accuracy 25. So we're being we're on par with their militia. So we need to really use our artillery. But let's fight. So we are uh, with militia. On par. When we get fire by rank, we will be have a, a minor advantage. But then again, this array is a pretty poor quality infantry as it is. Um so we're going to be really dependent on artillery, on our, on our artillery to make up the difference on your troops doing the work. Ooh, lovely. Oh, a high position. So my Feline are even worse. So my Feline end up needing to be... They end up needing to be in the centre so they can get the most support from each other. Let's get rid of this. Okay, let's... I mean, I probably want that. So let's... deploy at a slight angle. Let's take you... Flank. Let's take these guys to be the right flank. Put our Bashi Bazooks somewhere behind the line here. Let's put the Seminis here. Okay, let's. We need to get our. Our cavalry needs to do work. Which means casualties. Already take a bit of a advan advance um, advantageous position. Camels forward. Oh my, that's a lot of. Maybe not camels forward. Push our infantry up. Draw them into square into our square formations. And counter charge with our yeah square square keep moving our camels around okay, you guys can get out of square Switch straight to cast shot, start working on the militia. So we've got bayonets as well, so we're going to be that much more. We're going to have that much more strength in defending our positions. There we go, the opening. Actually, do this curve around at the top of the hill. Let's get some flanking shots on because our units are so big. They might not be good, but they're big. Uh, no, hold my camels back. Keep these guys in square formation because they're going to come back. Yeah. Square formation, hit the militia. Artillery start hitting the line infantry. Oh, yeah, 
actually attacked us with a provincial cow. Enjoy the camels, guys. So they're actually starting to engage us in skirmish order, which is exactly what they should be doing. So let's take... Let's go. Mamluk's ready to smash into this unit of line infantry when they break. Pikes, uh, that's a very bad position to have pike then. So let's get our cavalry in there immediately. Let's try to get semis in there. Camels into the armed citizenry. Push this unit somewhere like that. Cavalry's breaking full force. Redraw our line. Get our bash bazooks in. Them down a bit. Okay. We need those. I wouldn't be surprised if they came back, but not when not when my camels are having their way with them. Good. The plates are broken, so we can take our seminis, form our line. Muslims and the Bashwazooks get out of the way. Pull our cavalry back. The bodyguard's got itself in a silly position. Militia. You find the line infantry, you're winning, but not for long. Because you're all about to fall and flee. Even against the humble seminary. Let's get my camels to try and... Oh no, the general's routing in two directions. But is he over here? He's not in this cluster, he's in that cluster. into the militia. Well actually let's position our cavalry ready to do some good. Let's move our general around. Oh, 
cut him up. It's the general kill. Slice down the militia. Don't care if I get can't get some uh, collateral damage. Regiment of line infantry. So I think this speed up time. Because you're going to kill the pikes. Absolutely continue. Let's turn off our artillery. After this unit of militia, because they're almost dead. Come on, camel nomads. Charge in to help protect the general's bodyguard. Slice. Good lads, now just keep an eye on everybody. Just make sure they keep killing. Right, let's retarget you to go after that unit of line infantry instead. Stuff. They're going to kill this unit of line infantry. General's bodyguard's probably going to. Oh, I suppose he failed to kill these guys because they're all split up in a town. That always causes problems for pathfinding. And they hit everyone against. This unit of line infantry. There is a guy down here, though, somewhere. There he is. We captured a building, but damn right, it was a decisive victory. Boyd. Oh, look at that. They have a thousand men remaining. That's what you get when you declare on the mighty Ottoman Empire, you swines. They're a naturally occurring and resource and in this region Georgia. that are not currently being exploited. I'm not going to upgrade the mines. I mean, I don't think I've got any mines elsewhere. The Brits are coming, so I need to attack them. Let's upgrade this to a Bay's mansion. Let's upgrade. Not upgrade you to a Turkish bath yet. You can get a fur market. Greece can finally get their cannon foundry. Now, let's take this force as it is, which, I, which isn't ideal, to go and attack Himri de Massou. Let's do this. I'd rather have my artillery, you know, you, you go to war with the army you have, not the army you want. Let's do... do what we must. You so you guys didn't have a battle last turn, this turn you got two. One by one. Okay, so... We're fighting on a, on a billiard table, which is pretty good. It gives us lots of good... I actually need to nick, I need to nick some of these inside units. So there only have to be three units in the centre. But 
three units in the centre so I can have adequate protection on the flanks. There we go. And because this, this flank is anchored by the town, I'm going to want to put my cavalry and my melee troops all on one flank. General in the center. I mean, yes, please. Come here, Dragoons. Yeah, but you regret that now. Okay, so just make sure I'm not going to roll. Damn, charging. So let's get my deadly horseman out of there. The camels haven't lost a single cavalryman. Perfect shot against the four. Is that cavalry are going to fall? Okay, let's get you to start garrison shoot gar uh, canister shotting that infantry unit. Come on, Regiment of Horse, do it. They are. Let's let them charge on a bit further. Let's deploy my melee infantry into their unit of line. Nope, they're routing. Not routing, they're running. Good. So let's get my cavalry into their infantry to stop them from setting up and firing as usual. Let's back them up with the unit of Bashi Bazook. So let's get our camels to charge the we'll move towards their infantry. Where are their marines? There they are. Snipe their bodyguard. Okay, 
Okay, we've sliced. Nope. Okay, we need to... cooking. Let's get my deli horsemen to go after their field artillery. Their pikes are routed, which is heavenly, because they did charge my line in the middle. So their general's been killed. There goes your artillery. Just shooting the marines, you are probably going to hit that unit of marines. So I'm going to keep my cavalry in reserve to pick off their retreating troops. Now you engage there. Now you engage that pike man. Slice and dice, baby. I'm going to chase them down. Okay, now you intercept. The Delhi Horsemen having an absolute riot attacking these pikemen. Fire will on, so the 33rd are going to get torn apart by a bunch of fire from the already on the flank. Intercept them with a melee infantry unit. Kill that regiment. The camels right in the back over here are going to be dangerously far away. Okay, you guys abandon the muskets. I want you to kill the marines. Abandon the pikes, rather. You guys are going to successfully kill the 17th. They've been ridden down. Try cut off the 33rd foot. So the Denny Horseman, the target priority is the Marines. As 
is uh, the camel's priorities. Let's speed up time. Come on, the camels. Yes, the camels will kill their marines. Kill the other unit. Actually, kill the infantry unit. These guys are already on the marines. This will teach you... So teach them to land on the shores of Egypt. Your great men will die in the sand. Oh, come on, it's just these three marines. Got them. Close victory, my foot. Victory. We eviscerated them. They have 140 men remaining. March. And our army will stay there and wait for them to move in. Because we have no... Yeah, Dana's not developed, so that's not a concern. Sweet. Then yeah, let's take Muhammad Edem. And let's... Let's actually attack Yerevan. Lovely. So by the end of the session, I'll have, uh, I'll have made peace with the made peace with the Persians, knocked out the Georgians. Hey, it's snowing! Oh, not anymore. <laughs> it heard me. Oh no, there it is. Okay, Feline Musketeers moving from the front. The Orta are going to move in on the flank. My camels are going to be ready for them on the left flank, and then the remnants going to move up to support the Simonids. So you've got the front, move up to support the Felaim Musketeers and turn off the fire at will. Let's get the Mamelukes over there as well. Our guns are going to be up on this hill, plinking from long range. Granted, none of these guys can form square formation. You know. But these guys are going to engage in skirmish tactics. Who's that? That's the militia. Start opening up the armor skits. And you guys, you guys should be opening up. There we go. Send the Mamelukes against the Colonial Militia. Who's that at the back? Falling a little redoubt. Send two guys to flank. One guy to be the unfortunate guinea pig who faces them from the front. Smash! Slice them up. Intercept this regiment of horse with your smelly camels. I 
continue the charge. Don't worry about killing them. This is a city battle, and let's halt the fire with the artillery. Yeah, they're routing across the board. We are going to continue it. Um, because I want to use this as a good opportunity to get some to get some more experience. Ah, you'll never catch that cavalry. Sweet. Okay, come over and kill these stragglers at least. Yeah, they're going to rout. They've routed. They've routed. And yeah, this is the last unit on the board. These guys back here. And they're gone. Oh, no, wait. There is one more. Quick, everyone. All come over here to kill this garrison line. Our, f our former... Our former um, citizens, I shall point out, because these are garrison line infantry, they're made up from locals who were previously loyal to us. Ah, oh, they are going to make it. The little man who could. Decisive victory, damn right. There you go, this part's been... <laughs> Sweet. So we lost 144 men. Their entire army is dead. You guys should already like us because you're the same religion. And that is region captured. Armenia, nation destroyed. Georgia. Beautiful stuff. Right here. So I think that's actually quite a natural position to end the part. So thanks for watching guys. Hope you've enjoyed and we'll see you next time for the continuing adventures of the Ottoman Empire. Cheers everyone.